Hi everybody, this is Debbie with DebbieMaze.com and today we are going to be talking about the big mistakes that marketers make. So I'm hoping that by showing um, what these mistakes are that I can help you not make these mistakes in your business and that way you can grow and make as much money as you want. So let's talk about these mistakes that we see done every single day all over um, social media. So the first mistake that people um, do is that they don't understand that it's not what you want, it's what the market wants that matters. So if you're going out there and you're like, okay, I, I want to get somebody in my business, but the market only wants to buy your products. So if you, you're going to lose a client that way if you're pushing them to join your company and that's not what they want. They want just to buy your product. So you've got to be careful with um, how you do this and make sure that you find out what your market wants, not what you want. All right, so the other one, the other mistake is using hyped up claims to sell. Now, this doesn't work and all it does is make people angry and not trust you and they believe that you are a big fat liar. And we don't want that. You do not want a negative vibe coming your way. Now, yes, people are going to get angry with you, especially if you're starting to make more money than they are because that is so typical of human behavior. But that's okay. What you do not want is for people to be saying what you are saying is lying. Um, we see all the time these hyped up claims that, oh, um, this lady lost 200 pounds in 30 days. Look at this awesome picture. And guess what? You can totally tell that those two pictures are two complete different people by where tattoos are or, you know, we've, we've seen that. Those are hyped up claims that you want nothing to do with. You want to make sure that your claims are true and the things that you have seen, things that you have experienced, you want to provide value to your customers. Um, so another one is overselling and under delivering. So a lot of people will give up all of these claims and yes, we're going to be doing this and this and this. And then when it comes down to it, they only do one thing. So um, someone who is really, really good about um, underselling and over delivering is Mark Harbour. I love watching his webinars. I love watching his Facebook lives. He always over delivers on whatever he's doing. He never disappoints you. Um, another one, of, another friend of mine, I just watched a webinar of hers and at the very end she gave some value that is beyond measure. Um, something that I was hanging on to at the very end because I wanted it. I I didn't want to have to spend hours creating pictures and this and that, but she is so good at it. And so at the end, hey, I'm going to give some free stuff to people. And man, I stayed till the very end because I wanted that. She over delivered. This is something you want to keep people coming back for more. Am I going to be on her next webinar? <laughs> yeah, because I know she's going to over deliver. Am I going to be watching Mark Harbor's videos? Yes, because he always delivers. So if you do this, you're going to keep having people come back for more. That is what you want. Now, the last big mistake that marketers um, do is by putting the wrong offer in front of the wrong people. So let me give you um, a scenario. Um, someone walks into a room and they're selling makeup and they walk in there and they're giving this great presentation and then all of a sudden they realize that they're talking to a room full of men that do not wear makeup. Do you think you'd be selling makeup to that bunch of people? No, you won't. So you want to make sure 
that when you are marketing online that you are marketing your niche. You need to go find those people that want your product, that are looking to buy your product. Um, there are so many tricks out there. Um, I actually have some in some of my other videos that I've made. Go out there, figure this out. You guys can do this. So make sure that you're not um, making those big mistakes that so many other marketers are making. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Um, head over to my website at www.debbiemace.com for more tips and tricks of the trade. I'll see you guys next time.